welcome back. Today we're going to do an update on these fertile turkey eggs. Today is day 19, which means we've got nine days to go before hatch day. So we are going to pull them out again. I'm going to candle them again, show you guys how it's changed from the last video I just did with candling at day 11. I'll put a link up top and a description down below. I'm excited to see the progress. I haven't seen either. We'll see how much bigger they've gotten and if everybody is still growing strong. The last video that I did, there was one egg in there that I was skeptical about that I was pretty sure the embryo had died. And I did do a follow-up a few days later. There was still no growth, no movement, nothing going on. So I did take it out of there just so the egg wouldn't heat up too much and actually explode, which can happen, or it just start releasing bacteria. The only thing at this stage that you still need to do, just make sure your temperature is staying right around 99.5. If there is a couple of degree fluctuation, as long as it comes back to about 99.5, you will be okay. You still want the same humidity. So between 55 to 60% humidity is really good to achieve at this point as well. We're gonna get in here and we're gonna take a look at these. Once again, we wanna be pretty quickly about doing this. I'm gonna pull all five fertile eggs out to take a look at. My temp is running right at 99.1. All right, we're gonna go ahead and get started. Okay, go ahead and shut it, honey. Remember, like we were saying, the pointy end goes down in the incubator. It's about as dark as I can get it in the house right now. Okay. We're going to flip it over nice and gently. The turkey poult has grown quite a bit more. It's almost taking up the whole eggshell. I definitely got movement. Hold it here for a second. Oh, there you go. You can see like a leg kicking or veins moving. Okay, Emily. Okay. Here's our next one. Everything looks good in this one as well. Turkey's growing. We're gonna flip it over gently. Got a nice air sac down there. Oh uh, yep, definitely some movement. All right, egg number three. Okay, that all looks good. Nice color in there. Nice veins, nice air sac. Let's see. Just gonna turn it a little bit, see if. All right, egg number three looks good. We've got movement in this one as well. Here's egg number four. Okay, that all looks good. Egg number four looks good. We have a little bit of movement in there as well. Okay. Last but not least, we've got egg number five. Let's flip it over, everything's looking good. A lot of veins. Got a lot of movement in this one. A couple of them you could only see a little bit of movement in, which is fine. Some are probably a little bit more active right now. But I'm going to leave this on the camera and let you guys just kind of look at it moving around. You can see it kind of kicking, swishing around. All right, we're going to get this one back in the incubator. All right, well, that sums it up for day 19. All the turkeys look good. 
We're on track for day 25, which is going to be the day we pull our egg turner out and we basically put the incubator on lockdown. And we'll talk about what you should be doing at that time as well, setting up your brooder, picking up the feed so you've got everything you're going to need because from there on out, we've only got three days from hatch day after day 25. Thank you guys for watching this video and following along and once again, I'll keep you updated. Have a nice day.